Yo, what is up guys? It is Skarm, and for today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can get loyalty on your players, and of course, there is two methods to do this. Either you guys can do a quicker method, which will put losses onto your record, but I'm not too sure many people really care, especially considering it is kind of hidden. Along with that, the other method is, gonna, of course, going to be a no-loss glitch. Of course, in past FIFAs, uh, there has been a no-loss glitch where you guys can, like, Go into your PlayStation or Xbox settings, turn off your internet, turn it back on, and do that 10 times. However, this year it's a little different. It's definitely not as easy as doing such like last year and previous FIFA titles. Of course, though, before we do get into that, make sure you guys have your squad built. So, of course, I have my first XI squad from the first XI SBC. If you guys need a solution on that, of course, go check that out. Video is linked down below. But nonetheless, I have that entire squad on here. Make sure you guys, of course, have all the players that you do require. After that, of course, you guys can now either pick the squad battles mode or the friendlies mode if you guys want to go for the no loss glitch. So, of course, for me personally, I'm going to go do the no loss glitch one time just to show you guys exactly what I do mean by that. So, what you're going to want to do is go into the foot friendlies mode. And from there, you guys are going to go in to the play online section. Unfortunately, this does not work on couch play. Neither does that work with play a friend. So just keep that in mind. So of course, once you guys get to this screen, of course, it might be different. Of course, it might be different game modes for you at the time. But for me, there's one that's very, very simple to go through. It's, of course, called the new allegiance. Or, of course, I need a minimum of three leagues, which is going to definitely be very easy if you guys are doing the first XI SBC. It's definitely going to be very easy if you guys are trying to do this for SBC. BCs, which I mean that's pretty much the only reason you would want to do loyalty of course I can have a max of one alone player which I don't need to use either so it's basically I can just go straight into this game mode and go th right through it bear in mind if you guys are trying to do this in any of these game modes that aren't actually like the time based ones like of course the new allegiance and new beginnings then of course it would not work you can't play a mystery ball it just doesn't count you guys have to play one of the live game modes that are like limited time of course so of course i'm gonna go in to the new allegiance you guys might have to work around with your squad a little bit sub on players and stuff like that of course i'm gonna have to go remove some of these lone players because that doesn't count and it won't let me start the match with them so let me just go add those players right in here all right now that that's done of course we have the squad that i need the loyalty with so we're gonna go press advance search for an opponent and once i get there i'll let you guys know of course Alright, there we go. I finally got myself a game, so of course I'm going to advance. Hopefully the opponent on the other side does too. There we go. Finally. It seems like both of us are trying to get ourselves loyalty here. So of course, he's just going to have to go play for one minute here. And then kick it out. Alright, so there we go. We can just go quit the match. Both players, me and him, will both be getting ourselves a game of loyalty Alright, so now that I'm in to the squad, of course, I can go click on it to any of these players. And right there, you guys can see that each of these players have played one match. And you guys saw my opponent on the other end, already kind of knew this. And it, therefore, he was doing basically the same thing, trying to get his no loss. And I can assure you, friendly matches do not go on to your record. So, of course, if that's something you guys want to do, definitely that is an option. However, it just took way too long. I waited there for... About 17 minutes just to get one match. So, of course, the easier way of getting yourself loyalty, the quickest way of getting yourself loyalty, is definitely just going to be going in to your squad battles. Click on to featured matches, of course, and just keep going on any difficulty. It really doesn't matter. Now, I'm just going to go advanced right into a match. Do the same thing as I did in the friendlies. However, do it nine more times here. All right, so there we are. We're in it to a match. So, all I have to do is kick it out, pause the match and forfeit match all you guys have to do is just do the kickoff and you guys can quit right after that all right so now that you guys have seen i forfeited the squad battles match i can now go back to my squad just to prove that there has been two matches played on each of these players now there you guys go all these players have played two matches however me forfeiting this squad battles match will add on to my record so just bear that in mind you will get yourself losses but it is much quicker you guys saw it only takes about 40 seconds to get in a game and leave the match so now i'm gonna go repeat this process of course i also forgot to add on in case you guys aren't aware you guys can play the featured squad unlimited amounts of times so you guys don't have to waste your squad battle matches if that's something you guys really do care about so i'm just gonna keep playing this psg squad over and over and over again all right so i am now eight games completed so now I have to go add some contracts. Of course, everyone is going to go through this problem more than likely, at least. 
so you guys can add two to three contracts per player of course if you guys want to avoid having to put contracts on your players you guys can combine both methods you guys can play three of the games on the friendlies game mode which i did not do of course meaning i have to put contracts on these players if you guys play those three games on friendlies that of course isn't going to take up any contracts and then after that you guys can do the squad battles play your seven games which is of course going to be much quicker than the friendlies and that way you guys don't have to actually apply any contracts on to any of these players however of course i'm going to go add contracts on all of these guys and continue the last two matches i need to play and of course just to prove it a little bit you guys can see this green little badge around each and every one of these players this is not there before and of course you guys can see my chemistry went from 75 to 85 as well and each of these players do have 10 matches played so that's basically it guys that's how you guys get yourself loyalty it's pretty quick on the next gen console take about 10 minutes on the old gen console take about 15 maybe 20 minutes and if you guys try to do friendlies of course that could take much much longer apart from that though that is gonna be the video so please do make sure to like comment and subscribe and i will see you next time peace out